Hello students, so I got some questions for chapter 3 homework question number 8. In question number 7, you journalized these adjustments, now they need to go to the ledger. This is the ledger right here, requirement 2a. So you start with an unadjusted balance, you take it from this unadjusted trial balance, like cash is 34,000, so you put this right here. And you go through all of these accounts. You've got uh, teaching supplies, 8,000, accounts receivable, zero, teaching supplies, 8,000, <clears throat> prepaid insurance. So you just copy unadjusted balances, balances before you entered adjusting entries in question number seven, 12,000, so on so far. And then you look at your number seven, where you journalized adjusting entries, and you post them, copy them, post to the ledger. Like, for example, this first one, um, you debited insurance expense, and you credited prepaid insurance by 2400 So you post this data to each of the accounts. So you find insurance expense insurance expense right here so unadjusted balance i think was zero let me see insurance expense i'm sorry it was thirty three thousand okay thirty three thousand and now you're adjusting it by twenty four hundred so you have to choose letter a that was transaction a okay so then the system calculates balance after adjustment. 33,000 plus 2,400 gives you a balance of debit 35,400. You also post the credit to prepaid, in, prepaid insurance. So it goes right here, 2,400, letter A. Oh, I guess letter A goes right here. The amount goes right here. So we had $12,000 in prepaid insurance. We moved $2,400 to expense. So the remaining adjusted balance is $9,600. And so you do it for every account, for every adjustment. After you're done, you take adjusted balances from each account and put them together in requirement 2B for your adjusted trial balance. <clears throat> so think of the steps, think of the accounts and cycle. You have a picture of the steps in the accounting cycle in chapter three. We In chapters one and two, we did steps one, two, three, and four. We analyzed transactions, we journalized them, and we posted them to the ledger, and we prepared unadjusted trial balance, which is given to you. In this chapter, you are preparing adjusting entries, journalizing them in problem number seven, and then you're posting them to the ledger in this requirement to A, and then you prepare adjust trial balance. And then from this adjusted trial balance, you will prepare step five financial statements in reality. I hope it helps. Have fun with this chapter. It's a challenging one, but really provides a lot of great information.